हेलो एंड वेलकम टू द स्पेशल सेशन ऑफ दृष्टि पी सी एस आई एम ऋतु एंड टूडे सेशन इज अबाउट पेरिस पैरालम्पिक्स ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस इंपॉर्टेंट आस्पेक्ट्स ऑफ द पेरिस पैरालम्पिक्स एंड ऑल्सो ओवरऑल द एंड पैरालम्पिक्स जर्नी सो मूविंग टूवर्ड्स द डिस्कशन पार्ट सो विल हैव अ डिस्कशन ऑन हिस्ट्री देन विल हैव अ डिस्कशन ऑन इवोल्यूशन आफ्टर दैट वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस पैरालम्पिक स्पोर्ट्स and then we are going to discuss about the india's performance at paralympics and then india's paralympic performance 2024 and then we are going to discuss about the practice question for prelims so here we are going to discuss about the history evolution the medal tally of india and how india has improved itself in the paralympic games so we are moving towards the first thing which is about the paralympics origin so from where this particular paralympics game has been originated is it have a similar story with the olympics no it does not have a similar story with the olympics what here we can see that stoke mandeville and the history of paralympic the english town of stoke mandeville is known as a synonym for the paralympics because what we have seen that in the middle of the 20th century which is in 1944 on the request of british government what we have seen that sir ludwig gutmann opened a spinal injury hospital and later that hospital turned into a rehabilitation center where so many recreational activities has been conducted by this particular hospital and out of all those recreational activities just like lifting and everything we can see that these events had turned into a sports so from there we can see that there is a origin of paralympics game so in 1948 dr gutman organized the first competitive games for the athletes with impairments so those who are suffering from different kind of impairments disability so a game and a sports was organized for them now we'll come to the another thing which is about that from where this has been given and this has been coincided with the journey of olympics so what we can see that there was a olympic games in london in 1948 and fortunately it has coincided with the this particular game and there we can see that the first paralympic games so it was organized under the aegis of international stoke mandeville games federation and the first ever paralympics in rome saw participation of 209 athletes from 18 countries so earlier it was held in 1960 at rome and in which what we have seen that 209 athletes took part and 18 countries were participant of this thing but india was not participant of this game and what we have seen that from where this particular uh, paralympic term has been emerged through so this term has been emerged in 1988 in seoul and it has been designed and it has been denoted by the international olympics committee and uh, at that time seoul was witnessing the paralympics game so there we can see the 1988 and there we can see the origin of the term what you can say paralympics so it is not just the olympic is totally different and paralympics is totally different but the inspiration and everything is decided by the what you can say international olympics committee now we'll come to the another one which is about the paralympic sports so here we are going to discuss about the current situation that how many paralympic sports we have so there are currently 28 paralympic sports we have for summers we have 22 and for winters we have 6 and later what we have seen that in tokyo olympics which had happened in 2021 badminton and taekwondo also become a part of paralympics now we'll have a discussion on uh, the list of 22 summer Olymp paralympic games so here are the list archery athletics badminton football bokia para canoe cycling equestrian goal ball judo powerlifting wheelchair fencing wheelchair rugby wheelchair tennis uh, para swimming para table tennis so these are the examples and these are the list we have and these list are very much important for your examination because many times in upsc examination on in state examination they can ask you mcq like that whether these questions are or these a uh, sports are included in paralympics game or not and which are the new uh, addition to the paralympic game so these things are very much important so you must know that which kind of sports are played in paralympic games so this list is very much important so be careful and remember this list now we'll come to the winter one 
सो विंटर वन वी हैव वेरी फ्यू विच इज सिक्स पैरा एल्पाइन स्कीइंग पैरा बियाथलॉन पैरा क्रॉस कंट्री स्कीइंग पैरा आइस हॉकी पैरा स्नोबोर्ड व्हील चेयर कर्लिंग सो दीज आर द सिक्स विंटर पैरालंपिक गेम्स वी हैव नाउ विल कम टू द इंडिया एट द पैरालंपिक्स so as i have already told you that in the beginning of paralympics india didn't take part but from where this journey has began so this journey has began in 1968 at that time israel tel aviv was uh, witnessing the paralympic games so the first time india participated into this thing and at that time total 10 athletes took part and in which eight were men and two were the women and if you'll see that what is the performance of india in the first paralympic games so india came to the home medal list but it was the first real experience for the paralympians we have that how paralympian uh, had uh, they should witness different kind of the sports and it has encouraged them to be part of the such kind of the events so this is about the india's beginning to the paralympics then what we have seen that four years later in 1972 uh, at that time germany was witnessing the paralympics game at that time india secured its first medal and who had secured the first medal so para swimmer murli khan petkar set a world record time of 37.331 seconds to bag a gold medal in 50 meter freestyle swimming so this fact is very much important because in examination they can ask you that who was the first paralympians who had secured the medal for this country so we have this murli khan petkar and it is in the swimming and after that what we have seen that in uh, after getting the first gold in 1972 india did not take part in the further and paralympic games so india took part in olympic games but not in paralympic games and what we have seen that in 1984 summer paralympics was held in two separate uh, locations so after 1972 india took part in 1984 and it happened in two location one in the uk and another in the usa so this is about the paralympic game that india took part in 1984 and after that the journey of india didn't stop and the india delegation clinched four medals their highest from the competition to finish at the joint 37th position along with the south korea so in this event india secured the four medals and with the help of jukinder singh bedi so he alone had secured three medals and one is secured by bhimrao kesarkar who took the fourth medal for india with a silver in javelin and jukinder singh bedi has bagged silver in the men's shot put and then a pair of bronze medals in discus and javelin so you may have heard that when neeraj chopra won the first gold medal uh, in the last olympics so many people had said this kind of the things that it is because of neeraj chopra they got to know about the javelin sport but if you look at this data we have many uh, paralympians who had secured their medals in javelin so javelin was earlier a part of our sporting tradition it's just that we had not paid much attention to the paralympians and that's why we can see that the javelin was not much popularized but if you ask about the medals in javelin so we already had a medal in javelin so It, what we can see that it was contrasting fortune that india at the paralympics after registering their highest medal 1984 in 1998 and 2000 india struggled to finish the podium it means that india returned medal less but again this journey had started in 2004 and what we have seen that in 2004 india uh, indian player Devendra Jhajhariya won gold in javelin throw while Rajinder Singh won bronze in power lifting in 56 kg category so in 2004 again this saga has started and four years when beijing had witnessed the uh, paralympics india drew blank and after that what we have seen that india improved in 2012 and 2016 in 2012 india won a silver in london and hn girisha who won a silver in the men's high jump and only medal india won into this edition so this was the performance of indians in paralympics 2012 which had happened in london then uh, we'll come to the 2016 and in this rio games india had four paralympics medals the first is mariappan thangavelu who has won gold medal in high jump 
देन देवेंद्र झजरिया गोल्ड मेडल इन जेवलिन दीपा मलिक सिल्वर शॉर्टपुट वरुण सिंह भाटी ब्रॉन्ज इन हाई जंप सो एज आई हैव टोल्ड यू दैट जेवलिन वॉज इवन बिफोर पॉपुलर बिकॉज देवेंद्र झजरिया हैज वन टू गोल्ड मेडल्स इन जेवलिन एंड बिफोर पेरिस ट्वेंटी Tokyo 2020 was India's most successful Paralympic Games because there was a game-changing moment for India, and India has secured 19 medals in it. It was a huge improvement by Paralympians that from four they have come to 19, which was a very good performance by a country. Then uh, we'll come to the this uh, Paralympics, and this Paralympics has also broke all the record. and as you know that india had won 29 medals and this time we have 84 delegates who took part into this paris paralympics 2024 and what we have seen that they competed across 12 disciplines and uh, if you we'll see the number of players so it has significantly risen so earlier it was in tokyo it was 54 this time we have 84 in 2016 we have 19 in 2012 we have 10 so what we have seen that we have significantly improved that our paralympian players has increased so from tokyo it was 54 and right now it is 84 so we have increased the number of player and so many num- uh, players are taking part in different events so there are high chances that there will be more medal tally at the end of this game so now we'll come to the overall so as i have already told you that we have overall 29 medals which is a very good performance because from 19 we have become 29 so we have 10 more addition to this particular game and in 29 medals we have 7 gold 9 silver and 13 bronze and here there is a data that how we have improved so this is the gold one so in 2021 we have 5 gold medal in 2024 we have 7 gold medals in 2021 we have 8 silver In 2024 we have nine, and in Tokyo we have six bronze, and here we have thirteen bronze. So we have significantly improved. Though the Paralympics journey of India was so much of ups and downs, but since two editions we have improved a lot, and India had finished to eighteenth position this time. So what we have seen that India's Paralympic medal count by sport. So. here in different events we took uh, what you can say uh, we had secured the medal and this time india has also crossed the 50 medal mark so in swimming we have one medal in athletics we have 35 in badminton we have nine shooting nine archery three table tennis one powerlifting one and judo one so this is the journey of overall medal india has crossed the 50 medal tally and highest we have in the athletics so we have 35 medals from the athletics among which 8 gold medals 15 silver medals and 12 bronze medals we have so we have few new addition this time we have judo and powerlifting we already have seen table tennis last addition we have seen archery we have seen this time also so this is the thing then here are the list of paralympians who have secured medal and this is the list of this paralympics it means paris paralympics 2024 so we'll start with the avni lekhra avni lekhra has secured gold medal in shooting and mona agrawal shooting and this is for the first time that india has finished two uh, times at a podium it means that in a single podium there was mona agrawal and there was avni lekhra also then uh, we can see the uh, priti pal athletics Pritipal has secured the bronze. Manish Narwal shooting. She uh, he has secured in uh, air pistol uh, silver. Then Rubina Francis shooting bronze. Pritipal athletics women two hundred meter t thirty five bronze. Nishad Kumar athletics men's high jump silver. Yogesh Kathunia athletics men's discus throw silver. So here we can see the list of the. medals then we have another one which is about the manisha uh, we have this uh, murgeshan thulsamithi murgeshan badminton women single silver manisha ramdas badminton uh, bronze suhas yathiraj badminton silver rakesh kumar and sheetal devi archery bronze 
सुमित अंतिल एथलेटिक्स जेवलिन थ्रो गोल्ड नृत्या श्री शिवान बैडमिंटन ब्रॉन्ज दीप्ति जीवानजी एथलेटिक्स ब्रॉन्ज मरियपन थंगावेल्यू एथलेटिक्स ब्रॉन्ज शरद कुमार एथलेटिक्स सिल्वर सो दिज आर द लिस्ट वी हैव देन वी हैव अनदर लिस्ट सुंदर सिंह गुर्जर एथलेटिक्स ब्रॉन्ज सचिन खिलाड़ी एथलेटिक्स सिल्वर हरविंदर आर्चरी गोल्ड धर्मवीर एथलेटिक्स गोल्ड परमाओ सुरमा एथलेटिक्स सिल्वर कपिल परमार जूडो वी हैव फर्स्ट मेडल इन जूडो ब्रॉन्ज प्रवीण कुमार एथलेटिक्स हाई जंप गोल्ड होकातो होजना सेमा एथलेटिक्स ब्रॉन्ज सिमरन एथलेटिक्स ब्रॉन्ज सो वी हैव ईच प्लेयर्स हैज अ डिफरेंट एंड यूनिक स्टोरी टू टेल एंड यू कैन सी दैट विद द हेल्प ऑफ एसिस्टिव टेक्नोलॉजी विद द इन थ्रू आजम एंड वॉट यू कैन से इनकरेज बाई द गवर्नमेंट एंड देयर ओन सेल्फ डिटर्मिनेशन वी आर एबल टू सिक्योर दिस ह्यूज नंबर ऑफ मेडल्स नाउ वेल कम टू दैट विच कंट्री हैज वन हाउ मेनी मेडल्स सो दिस पर्टिकुलर पेरिस पैरोलम्पिक्स हैज बीन टॉप बाई चाइना एंड चाइना इज एबल टू सिक्योर टू ट्वेंटी सिक्स मेडल्स आफ्टर दैट वी हैव ग्रेट ब्रिटेन वन ट्वेंटी फोर देन यू एस ए वन हंड्रेड फाइव एंड देन नीदरलैंड फिफ्टी सिक्स एंड ब्राजील एटी नाइन If you look for the India's performance, India has secured twenty-nine and it has got eighteenth position. So this is about top twenty countries' Paralympics. So in examination, maybe they can ask the India's position. So you already know the India's position; it is eighteenth, and they can ask top two or top three or top five. So here we had already discussed the top five. Now we'll come to the conclusion part. So this has been the performance of India till now. and this particular aim and this particular uh, what you can say successful paris paralympics has been applauded by prime minister narendra modi and also various uh, social media we can see that so many uh, players are trending and why they are trending because right now people are also watching their games and they are also gaining the acknowledgement and they have been also received a very warm welcome and what all this suggest that all this suggest that there is a sports awareness happening in the country and especially the para sports and it's very important because the person who are suffering from different kind of disability often seen as a burden but all these sports and medal events gives them encouragement and it also shows that how many types of disabilities exist and it also uh, develop a sports person spirit among the persons and here we can see that earlier we do not have much equipments to play but right now the technology has developed we have mechanical thing we have electronic technology we have so many assistive equipments which are helping players to play their sports and live their life and uh, complete their dream so the overall conclusion is that from earlier if we'll compare from the earlier the sports culture has evolved throughout the years though paralympics journey was has lots of ups and downs sometimes we return country medal less sometimes we have only one or two sometimes even four but from past two edition india has done so much better and it is showing that india has a very bright future in terms of the para sports so it's very important for the government for the people to have awareness regarding the sports culture and it will give enthusiasm and power to the people who are suffering from different kind of disability that they are no more burden they are asset and they are pride for this nation now we'll come to the question round the question is what is the position of india in the paris 2024 paralympics medal tally 14th 18th 20th 16th so this we already had discussed and you have to also prepare this topic for your mains sometimes they can be question related to the mains that how Uh, the with the help of government and with the help of different kind of awareness program and technology we can boost our the para sports so this can be mains question for you i hope you like this session if you have any queries related to this session kindly ask in the comment section thank you and have a nice day for more informative content like share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications